back to Persona 5 Royal with me, Matthew Caddis, Iggy Poogie. So, today we are going back to um, Station Square in Shibuya to actually find that politician who we met in the uh, beef bowl shop because we want to learn a thing or two from him. Yes, because he is one for giving out huge speeches. Um, just don't um, uh, think you... Uh, let's say we are interested, even though Ryuji don't like politics. And to be honest, if I try and mention it on YouTube, um, he may well... Um, someone might say he's woke. I don't know if he is, to be honest, is this um, politician. I guess I'd probably have to avoid him like the wind or something. And yes, I do know what woke means. I don't know, it's certainly idealistic, I'll give him that. Washed up politician? Uh, what are you talking about? I know I'm only a young lad, but, or at least, um, Rennie's anyway. Uh, the best interest of all, the heckling, yeah, that got in the way. Uh, let's just say, we won't get elected, well, let's say we, he has our support. And apparently this politician is called Yoshida. Okay. And we don't gain anything from him. Weird, because the uh, confidant with Yoshida here is easily one of the um, easiest confidants in the game to actually max. It looks like you're attending school seriously. You also seem pretty close with Takamaki-san if you're both coming to school together. You just transferred here, though. I guess you two really click. I see. You seemed a lot closer than that yesterday morning. I heard she was a victim of Mr. Kamoshida. But was that all there was to it? Either way, closer inspection should clear everything up. Goodbye. Okay, I think Makoto Nijima may actually have our number here. Seriously, she seems a lot smarter than anyone we've met thus far. Anyway, Mr. Inui has another question here. About the Heian period, eh? I'm terrible with Japanese history, seriously. Magistrate's patronage? Uh, why do you keep asking me in the picture of. Um, I did say the Heian period, didn't I? Or was this just about comprehension? I don't know. All I remember from that is probably Genji, which was an action game. All right. And our knowledge went up. Yes, it doesn't help us fight giant enemy crabs, but um, it certainly helps with our social links. And yes, I'll use social links and confidants interchangeably, I think. So where do we want to go now? We could go down to Mementos. We only have one target, though. From Mishima, so yeah, I want to wait until we get a few more targets to go to Mementos. So that's out. So what about Ryuji? Well, we can advance our confidant with him. So I say, yeah, let's do it. Especially since um, a little later on, we'll actually take a pause with his confidant. Protein lovers, Jimmy. Bullshit contracts. I don't know, I've never been to a gym myself. Way, Usually walk me dog. Um, a towel, I guess? Okay, then what else then? Protein pills? No, that, those are steroids, aren't they? No, they're not steroids. Certainly not steroids, I don't want any of those. Uh, 
Spirit Undies? Why? We're gonna do crap up. Oh, sweat, yes. Okay, well, we can also go to the sports gym. And we'll be spending a lot of time with uh, both um, Ryuji here and. Uh, your form's coming back, but you don't get any stamina? Um. What now? Is that Takeshi or. Rada Senpai? I've never heard of him. You know him, Ryuji? Leg? Well... Wait, why? Why? What? What's it? Huh? Amauchi? You know that guy? What do you mean that Yamauchi? Is he as bad as Kamashida? Hmm. Yeah, he does. Not really? You sure, Ryuji? There's an asshole? Uh... Hmm. Just like, look like we've exchanged one for another. Hmm. Um, I guess, but... Let's see what we get for rank 5. Okay, we really are... I'm getting up there. Nothing new for that one. Yeah, you better. You don't want to smell Ryuji. Anyway, back to LeBlanc and... What does he say now? Bonking? Uh, yeah. Let's have his back at least. Okay, fair enough. So next, let us. Uh, well, it's now evening, so let's see. Hmm. Oh no, we can uh, do another crossword. So let's see. What is the solution for it this time? What are the Mary Blue? The Mary Blues? Um, Mal. I'm not sure about this one. Malays? I think. Even though Malays can mean anything, really. Um, so, yeah. Okay. Normally, um, I get hay fever in May. Though right. so that can happen in April. Yeah, seriously. Yeah. Even though I love the spring, yeah, I can get pollen up my nose. It isn't fun. Uh, that being said, let's go to the, again, the station square. And, um, let's see. Is uh, Mr. Yoshida here? He is, but we can't advance... Can we advance the confidant with him? Uh, why don't we have another listen, then? Um... Yeah, I don't think he's old enough to be a politician, is, uh, Ren. And while our society appears to be prosperous, many of our young people are quietly suffering. They lack jobs, security, savings. The next generation will lead us into the future, and yet they have no plan for how to arrive there. Watch where you're going, you little shit. You bumped into me, you old goat. This isn't good. This is no time to run away. Good citizens, please stop fighting. What is the point of being...
bickering over such a trivial matter. This is none of your business. Yes, yeah, seriously, just shut up. What's with this guy? Now, if you'll please excuse me, I must return to my speech. Together, we can create a bright future for the next generation. Ugh. God. So righteous. That really annoys me. Enough of your arrogance, no good, Torah. What? As if anyone would actually vote for you. Are you planning to embezzle funds again? Or maybe criticize one of your constituents again? You criminal! No, no. That, that was all in the past. <sighs> I've gone and done it again. I can't do that in my situation. Regardless, whenever someone calls me no good Torah, I panic. I went through quite an ordeal 20 years ago. Let me explain. I used to be a member of the National Diet. I was elected during the rise of the Kuramoto children. We were backed by powerful Diet members. This was about 20 years ago. I was very inexperienced back then, both as a politician as well as a human being. That inexperience led me to be involved in a series of major political scandals. People refer to my blunders as no good Torah's three strikes. The first was being caught missing a legislative meeting to take a personal vacation. Then, I was accused of embezzling a large sum of money from the party, giving me two strikes. Finally, I called a voter an idiot at an open forum, which resulted in scandal and strike three. I was out, and branded a washed-up politician. You said you wanted to become a member of the Diet. But do you see the man before you? Do you really want to receive my guidance? I'm happy to hear that. However, everyone says I have no chance to get elected. So why come to me? You mean giving speeches? I'm afraid I'm not so great that you'd be able to learn anything. Mm. The most important part about giving a good speech is believing in yourself. Perhaps one day I will believe in myself again. But you sure got me there. You're a strange young man. Very well. If learning how to give a great speech is what you seek, then I'd be happy to instruct you. In exchange, I would like for you to continue assisting me. Let's get started, shall we? Staging your crimes with calling cards. It's hard to believe that a student could manage this alone. An adult. For example, someone talented enough to move people with words. Perhaps they coached you. Isn't that right? I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the Sun Persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. All right. Let's pursue your dream of becoming a member of the Diet. Oh my, we've been talking for far too long. Let's call it quits for today. Yep, apparently we have uh, made a deal with uh, no good Taro, or should I say Taranosuke Yoshida, the politician who we saw um, earlier. Okay. Well then, I shall 
see you again soon. Sure. It might well be of use to the Phantom Thieves. Anyway, that being said, we are going to uh, emerge on a rainy day, it seems. And a school assembly? What's going on here? Hmm, okay. Is this about Kamashida again? Ow. Before that, we have to do our, our exams. Oh yeah. So, these our exams are basically um, going over most of the questions we were done. So, it's Minamoto no Yorimoto. That is the answer to the first one. Who is a hero? Why is Yoshi Tsune? Uh, that would be Yorimoto. Um, let's see. Yorimoto 1. So why is Yoshi Tsune seen as the hero then? So I'm gonna say the weak, or yeah, the weak. Yep. An underdog. <laughs> that is probably the more, much more the truth there. However, we still have many more days of exams to do. Yep, and this was the case also in Persona 4 as well. So what's next then? Uh, let's see, that would be... Not exaltation, COGNITION! What do you do with that dealing with perception, so yeah, COGNITION. Um, both, maybe? I'm not sure. Yeah, some of the, the questions are somewhat skewed a little differently from how the teachers have taught us, shall we say, thus far in the game. Let's get started. So what's the next one? In fact, okay, you've got, you've lost me there. Digital Devil Story! <laughs> oh boy! Nothing to reference that at least! A PS2 game, another of the Megami Tensei games, but yeah. I kind of missed that question because of that, but yeah. Digital Devil Story. Although it was Digital Devil Saga over here, I think. So yeah. We won't get our results until a little later on, however. If we get every question right, um, we do add to our knowledge and charm, however. Ever since that specific incident, many of you have voiced concerns that I could not bear to ignore. We believe the mental health of our student body is absolutely vital, so we've acquired the services of a therapist. The floor is yours, Doctor. Whoa, isn't he hot? <laughs> it's not you all. Whoa, his voice is sexy. My name is... Huh? My name is Takato Maruki. Thank you for welcoming me to your school. No need to be formal with me, though. I'm just here to counsel anyone who's interested. You can even call me Doc, if that would help you feel more comfortable. Any assistance you need, I'll be... Oh. I guess I'm not really any good for helping with money problems. <laughs> Thank you, Dr. Maruki. Yo. You ever expect this place to actually give a shit about our mental health? Well, our schools made national news. Maybe they figured they'd look even worse if they didn't do anything for us. And Dr. uh... Dr. what's his name? Maruki. Yeah, wasn't that guy just basically clowning it up on stage? Do you really think he'll do us any good? Are 
Yuji. Hey there. Sakamoto-kun and Takamaki-san, right? And that must make you. How do you know our names? Well, I was informed of certain students before beginning my tenure here. Those that had, uh, previous interactions with Mr. Kamoshida. It must have been especially tough for you after having just transferred here. I can definitely believe that. So, what do you want with us? Ah, yes. I'd forgotten. I know I already offered my services to the student body earlier, but would you three be interested in counseling? Nope, not at all. Huh? How's that surprising? You were just a touch more emphatic about it than I'd expected. Ah, but if you come to my office, you can have free snacks. All you can eat would be nice, but there's still plenty to be had. So, how about it? Hey, don't fall for that! To be frank, I've been explicitly ordered to provide counseling to the students directly involved with Mr. Kamoshida. It's in the school's interest. For its students. Ah, the school's interest, huh? I know that asking you to be open with a complete stranger like myself is a lot. Making this mandatory wouldn't do you any good either. Might as well turn it into a worthwhile experience. Ooh, I know! If you attend my counseling sessions, I'll teach you different ways to improve your mental acuity. Like ways to hone your concentration before exams, or not getting nervous on dates. How's that sound? Uh... There's also snacks. All right, all right, enough with the snacks. So, which way are you leaning? <sighs> I guess it'd just be more trouble for us if we didn't go. Hmm, yeah. Really? Then, I guess it's a deal. I'll be in the nurse's office. Feel free to come by whenever it's convenient for you. Well, we should get going. Okay, I'll see you later. Thanks for taking my counseling into consideration. Now that we have a deal, I promise I'll do my best to help you. It's hard to believe an ordinary high school student could accomplish such grandiose heists. One would need a heart of steel, unaffected by outside influences, and prepared to act without hesitating. There has to be someone who helped strengthen your mental state. Sound like somebody you know? Give me a name! I am Thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the Counselor Persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. All right. So hold up, dude. Sorry for keeping you like this. Well then. Believe it or not, Dr. Maruki will become one of the most important confidants in the game. Seriously, I am not even joking. But, um... I'll get to that a little later. We are going to gain a few more, another point, towards his confidant um, in this very episode, actually. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. After all the snacks! Even though, uh, yeah. After all, um, what could it hurt? Yep, so let's indeed go and speak to Dr. Maruki here. 
even if he's a bit clumsy. But apparently, he's speaking to Am first. <laughs> well, Am's been through a lot, seriously. Especially with what happened with she ho hmm. Yeah, just don't talk about the castle there, Anne. Seriously. I don't think he'd believe it. She who is currently getting better. Yeah. Change the future? How the hell do we change the future? Unless when, um, yeah. someone here is psychic? I don't think Dr. Maruki's psychic! Certainly seems like a good start to um, the counselling. Uh, let's ask how it went. Really? Okay, well, let's go and see Dr. Maruki then. And see what he's. Apparently, he's seeing uh, Yoshizawa as well! How are you? Okay. Apparently, um, Yoshizawa knows him. I'm, I'm quite surprised at that. I wonder how she knows him. Seriously. Right. Anyway, um, yeah, I, I guess so. Uh, please be gentle. Welcome. Uh, no problem, I guess. We did make a deal. Yeah, especially since we were dealing with the, I'm going to say, it's almost been my privacy, I'm not sure about that, um, let's say we're doing okay now, by comparison at least we're doing okay now, no we weren't, Hell, even Sojiro was quite pissed at us, seems a bit pissed now as well, um, well maybe that's just how he is. Okay, now we're talking about some weird stuff. Um, kind of sounds right anyway. I'm sorry. Uh, no problem, I guess. Do I want what? How about it? Um, yeah, I definitely need more details. Oh, okay. I, I know you're a doctor, but you're doing medical research as well? Uh, why am I a lifesaver? Show you you're a bit clumsy, but, um, yeah. And after that, we actually gain another level with things, so, yeah, apparently we can recover, um, almost immediately from any ailment, thanks to Detox X. Yes, that is one of the new things added. In, in fact, the whole counselor confidant with Maruki here is, has been added to this game. Anyway, that being said, I will indeed end the episode here, and um, I will see you on the next one. Goodbye!